Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm showing you how I got this quick and easy hairstyle. Watch me go from this to that. Oh, wait, wrong video. No. Uh, yeah, that one to that. This will be the second video in my Fix a Fail series. So stay tuned and watch how I turn that dry, dusty poof into these cute little poofs. <laughs> I just went to sleep. Um, a bitch was tired. I have time to do no twist, no LOC. So I went to bed straight how my hair was, and I woke up like this. It's a little better. Well, it's definitely gonna have to do for today, especially because this is where I started off. Like, who else has done this? You're tired at night, you don't feel like putting twists in your hair, so you just leave that poof in and you go to sleep. Well, this is how I wake up when I do that. So I try not to do it, but when I do do it, you always have to have a recovery plan. And for me, it normally is my two poofs. So I kind of had it in the back of my mind that that's what I was gonna do anyway. But for the sake of this video, I'm gonna show you guys how I get it cracking. The first step is to moisturize. So I'll split my hair into two sections, start by spraying a little bit of water, and then I'm gonna go into the LOC method. L is for your leave-in conditioner, O is for your oil, and oh yeah, wait, I'm not doing a C. So it's just, I'm just gonna basically moisturize my hair. <laughs> Now, as I'm applying the leave-in conditioner, I try to pay attention to the ends, especially, and then the extra dry spots that I have going on. Um, I also use this time to do some detangling, which will help when I'm trying to put my hair up in the ponytail. Next, I'll go in with the oil. I try to apply that to my scalp and my strands. Now, when it comes to edges, everyone has their own preference. For me, I don't do baby hairs and I don't like slicked edges, but I'm gonna need y'all to at least get information. You're not gonna be grouped all together off to the side like that. So I do have a soft bristle brush and I do have my Eco Styler Girl. And I use these a combination with each other. So I'll lay some gel down and then I'll brush my edges up. I don't do anything extra like tying a scarf and waiting 20. Ain't nobody got time for that. Okay, so once my hair is all moisturized, I'm gonna start getting into that ponytail. I use the pick to help me pull my hair, to stretch my hair out and gather it together. And then once I get it all together, I'll go in with the pick again just to pull it and make sure that all my hair, all the curls have moved through where I'm gonna put the ponytail. But I'll just continue to keep slicking and pulling and slicking and pulling. And then I take that ponytail holder and I work it down. And I'm not gonna pull my hair all the way through. I'm gonna leave it in like a little tight bun and you'll see how I do that here. And then once I'm done, I will just do the same exact thing to the other side of my hair. Now you already see I got that bang swooped and sectioned off to the front because I have to have a bang. And I'm not making nothing look easier than what it really is. Like, this is seriously how simple it is. And I get the most compliments when I wear my hair like this. And it's so super easy. Now for the bang, I will, I sprayed some water on my hands and then put some conditioner on my hands. And then I go through and basically just try and soak up the dryness of it. I'll try and do a little bit of twirling, but like... <laughs> Who am I fooling? You better get you some of this 4C goodness. Looking for the one one bitch you looking at the one Looking for the one one bitch you looking at the one I'm the best yeah and yeah my best is yet to come 
thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already, go ahead and follow me on Instagram and Snapchat. That's where I post the most. But until then, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. Oh, dude.